it seems that the body of an Indian national was recovered on the second day of the search for uh, the missing buses. Remember, viewers, two buses carrying around 63 passengers were swept away into the Trishuli River due to a landslide on the Madan Akshrit Highway in central Nepal. Now, teams of the Nepali Army, Nepal Police and Armed Police personnel, including deep divers, are at the action uh, incident site. But of course, the body of an Indian national has now been uh, recovered. There are about five uh, to six Indian nationals are believed to have uh, perished in this landslide as well. Brian's still with us on the broadcast with more details. Brian, over to you. Uh, well, Pia, you know, the bodies of an Indian and a Nepali national were recovered from the embankments of the Narayani River, um, you know, that happened uh, yesterday as part of the search operation, where two buses swept away by a landslide in central Nepal. Now, divers are also suspended the search at nightfall and will resume uh, today morning. Now, yesterday afternoon, also the body of an Indian national, who is identified as Rishupal Shah, was recovered from Golaghat in Chitwan, approximately... Um, 50 kilometers downstream from where the vehicles were swept into the river by landslide. And the brother of Rishupal Shah also identified the body and the body has been brought to Bharatpur Hospital and will be handed over to the family upon completion of the procedures. Uh, debit cards were also issued from two banks in Nepal and an Aadhaar card were also retrieved from his body as said even by Indradev Yadav who is the TDO of Chitwan. Now on Saturday, that is yesterday also, the police also recovered two more bodies from the embankments of Narayani River, uh, which are suspected to be passengers who were on board the ill-fated vehicles. And one of the bodies has also been confirmed to be that of a Nepali national named Ramit Kishore Madhi, according to the very, uh, very uh, CDO as well. And the father of Ramit Kishore Madhi, a passenger on board the vehicle mm. that has been missing since Friday morning, identified the body later uh, that evening. And according to the district police office also in Chitwan, mm. one of the bodies were found today uh, was who was uh, floating in the river while the other was buried in sand. And the all right, Brian, with that, I would like to thank you for joining us on the broadcast, sharing all those details. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.